So my name's Katrina McAuliffe and I'm one of the partners on our family farm. So we've been on this um, property since I was um, six, so that's uh, a little while now. We've had a lot of droughts come and go over the years. This is the first time that I can remember that we've had a real problem with the water situation with farm dams. We need to look at what options are out there in order to save costs and future proof the, the farm for conditions, whether they get worse or better. So I was introduced to the Business Energy Advice Program through New South Wales Farmers, um, which was a fantastic experience. We'd already made some decisions about what we could do in terms of reducing our costs, but the program has certainly been able to give us some other options and give us advice as to some of the savings, whether it be with LED lights or incentives that um, can help us install and implement some of the things that we've been thinking about. One of the things that we found really good was that it's a um, Australian government initiative and it's run by a not-for-profit. So that gives you a real peace of mind in knowing that it's um, a genuine program and it's got the backing of the government. The cherry on top for us was that it's a free service, getting great advice by a trusted not-for-profit, but it's free. So how good is that? I was talking to Joel from the Business Energy Advice Program and although we'd invested in solar quite some time ago, it was interesting that Joel pointed out to us that we hadn't actually been using the solar generated power and whilst it was feeding into the grid, we were getting our eight cents a kilowatt, but we weren't actually using the power that was being generated. So that's something now that we have to go back and, and sort out with our um, installation guys. After talking to Joel, we realised that the 18% discount had dropped off our existing contract and have switched providers basically. So we now have a higher amount of solar feeding credits and we get a cheaper bill at the end of it all. That in itself was a really quick way of saving money for our business. So the money that we're saving on our new energy bill contract, we will be able to put that towards buying new infrastructure, such as the water solar pump that we're just putting in. As a member of New South Wales Farmers, I'm delighted to hear that um, the government have extended this initiative to farmers that are drought affected. So I highly recommend it. It's free. Why wouldn't you do it? You've got to take advantages of these. They don't come often enough helping farmers in times of drought. So, you know, get out there and, and do it and talk to the guys at the Business Energy Advice Programme.